everyone can relate to the themes in the show. So everyone goes through love and loss, happiness, sadness. And exploring sexuality as well, and it will definitely, I think, reach out to a lot of people around the world. Because, like, this episode's sort of my story, so every single camera shot's been on me. I've not had, like, there was no time when I've had a chance to sort of, like, hang out and have a chat with you. So the first two days that we were shooting, yeah. I've just been really horrible to you, and I'm going, like, so bad. Yeah. It's so awful. He seems lovely. I've been a professional performer for the last 10 years. I do stand up and like this is my first proper acting job. So I was like, I was really, really nervous about it. Like I'm half expecting every day, like halfway through, we've got, oh no, we've made a terrible error. We found you out. No, you're not supposed oh, no, to be I here. Oh no, I every day. I think every day. That's the thing that. <laughs> it never goes away that. They have qualities in each other that if they, if you kind of put them both together, they'd be like the perfect person sort of thing. Yeah. <laughs> so Dean's quite wild and loud and funny and, and Scott is quite a romantic and slightly more mellow. So Dean can kind of perk her up and she can kind of chill Dean down. It's really lovely. Wow, I never thought about that. Yeah. <laughs> That's really good. I think he's been playing hardball and now he's met his match. Yeah. And you've stood at your character stood up to him. Yeah. And, and now ego's kicked in and he can't handle that and now he wants it all back to normal again. I know that Eddie is not happy with that situation because yeah. of what then follows. The lens that he then he then goes to yeah, to because pursue her and yeah. to get this back on track. <laughs> yeah, yeah he's and then doing himself no favors. Yeah, he doesn't. He had, it's not a very well thought yeah. out. Yeah, it's it's method not been, it's, it's, Yeah, <laughs> yeah, he really hasn't thought through his end game. Yeah. <laughs> been a blast working with this one. Cause she's very yeah. funny. And, and I told him to stay keeps the <laughs> keeps the energy up. When we met in the read through, we never knew that the chemistry would be so good because mm -hmm. we literally do things outside of set and literally find out that we have so much in common. Yeah. It's like past relations. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Boom, love, interest. And uh, music, especially. Music. Music. So lucky. I'm so over the moon to be working with Georgia. This one. Uh, we're so happy to be <laughs> working so together. We really are, honestly. We've Our had... chemistry is sizzling. Uh, sizzling. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm so, and she's so beautiful. I did say, I said to all of my friends before I started this, I hope I'm the ugly one. And um, I mean, like, I don't want to put you on the spot or anything, but I definitely done well for myself. I'm really happy. I am very happy. I'm fit. Yeah. <laughs> I went for an audition for uh, Children's Ward, which I didn't get on ITV, which is one of Russell's other shows. Um, oh. And and I believe that you got it, didn't you? Oh, you should have. You would have been mad better than me. Got that in the trick. <laughs> I was a massive fan of massive Russell T. Davies, a fun fact. We went to the same school in Swansea. He went to Olkva. He went there, I mean, you know, a couple of years before me, but we're both on the wall together when I met him in the read through. It was like, you know, you meet these Wonderful. people. Wonderful. And he's been giving us feedback as well after watching some of the rest of it. I'm like, it's, it's great. I feel that, if you don't mind me saying okay. it, Fizz is, has a vulnerable side to him that's that not many people can see unless you sit down and talk to him. And I feel that like Dean hides that a lot yeah. with his charisma and his charm and his fun, um, vibrant spirit. Yeah, I think there's uh, the romantic side of Scotty. I think Letitia has quite a bit. Um, I think Letitia's a bit of an old romantic, so I think on that, on that level they're, they're, they're quite similar. I think they have the same view of love and, and yeah. what that should be. But Letitia's a bit more, uh, uh, maybe a bit more wild at heart <laughs> than, uh, than Scotty. A tiny bit. A little bit. A little bit. <laughs>